Hey, come. Shh, shh. Hey, come. Hey, shh. Hey, come. Look at the double man. Hey, shh. Yeah, see how I can just step on the leash and stop him? Shh. 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 Hey. Knock it off. Hey. Knock it off. Don't do that. Hey. No. There's a lot of emotions going on. Who's so crying? These two right here. As the Doberman grows up, she's getting she's getting more confident. Remember, she used to punk her all the time. Now she's not allowing that. And so they're around the same age. So they're fighting for their position in the pack. You see how they're doing that right there? Hair standing up. Come, come, shh, shh, right here, sit, sit, no, hey, sit, good, a knock, sit, good, good, down, okay, so that's why it's good to have obedience so that way you can stop them, redirect the mind, let them focus on me. You don't want them focusing on each other because then that's when a dog fight goes out. So if you're used to doing obedience, then you can, you can, um, down, good. You can redirect their mind, down, good. Knock, let's go. So I'm gonna keep moving so that way they don't get stuck fixating on themselves. I'll record as much as possible. There they go, drink the water. Just want to document how they are together. Miss B isn't here every day. She's only here weeks at a time. So one week and then she's gone for a week. So I think it's important for me to to um, do activities with them together so that way they get used to it, used to being together. Knock, no. Shh, shh. out. The more they're together, supervised, the more I can uh, show them how they're supposed to be playing around. 